It'll be Team World off the tip. And it's just something about the Rising Stars Challenge. It gives each of these young players a chance to really do something special on a national stage, maybe for the first time in their professional career. You know, sometimes making it difficult for him to finish at the rim is all you can ask for from the defense. Pass to Ivy. The dish to Barnes. Here's White. Basket counts. And for this young man, this game is serving as kind of a coming out party, if you will. A lot of fans haven't seen him that often during the regular season. And that's one of the neat things about the Rising Stars Challenge. It's a way for some talented young players to get their first taste of the national spotlight. Here's Shengun after the made shot from White. Shengun passes to Sharp. Just five to shoot. Over Ivy. And it's Sharp missing. You brought the big stage these young guys around tonight. For so many of the fans, Greg, who are still, uh, you know, just getting familiar with these players, it really is a great welcome to the NBA moment. It, it really is a showcase. And for each player, whether they have great moments or not, just being chosen to participate is a huge honor. And, and it says a lot about where they stand amongst their peers. Here's Shengun after the made shot from White. And it is flushed down with a nice jam. Nothing <laughs> soft about the putback there. And why chance it, right? Take the duck if you've got it. Well, you know, if nobody's going to put a body on him, then that's going to be the result. White, that's it. And he's now three for three and looking sharp. And guys, since this game started back in 94, this has been a perfect warm-up for the All-Star game. I mean, it has all the fun and excitement of the big game with the added element of introducing some of the great young stars to the league's fans. Here's Giddy after the made shot from White. And it's Sharp missing. Now, here's Van Carroll. Tight defense on him. The feed to White. Makes it off the glass. White's got eight. This really has become one of the signature events of All-Star Weekend. And I know you love it, Greg. It gets everyone into the mood for all the festivities that are soon to come. Yeah, it, it does. I mean, it's such a great way for these young players to show off some of the fancy moves that they wouldn't even dare to attempt in a regular season game. Here's Giddy after the made shot from White. Here's Wagner. And finish off by Wagner. Wagner. And the and one on tap. Great determination that time. Owens has checked in for USA. I love this event so much because it combines the world-class ability of these players with the freedom of the playground. Yep, it's the greatest and certainly the most fun pickup game these players will ever play in. Now here's Barnes. Two minutes remaining. Feeds the white. The kick out to Barnes. Second chance effort, and it's White getting it to go. He's got 10. You've got to box out on the boards. When you don't, that's what happens. Wagner outside. There's the pick. Got it. Good job in the low post. Wagner's got his second basket of the game. And some players in the Rising Stars Challenge aren't especially well-known yet. But this young man is someone we've already become very familiar with. It has not taken him long to really establish himself in the league. I mean, he's been logging a ton of minutes. Team World trails by three. 107 left in the first quarter. Passes it to Shengu. Good ball movement here by Team World. Giddy, no good. Well, you know, this is what happens. You can't afford to lose concentration even for a nanosecond. Pass to Ivy on the wing, Barnes. They get it again. White and a good offensive board, and he gets the bucket. White's got 12 in the game. Yeah, and how about the performance we're seeing from him? Not one miss on the day. Wagner outside. There's the pass to Shengu. 
up and in. Off to an efficient start. Two for three from the field. Whatever the defense gives, that's what he takes. A sign of a skilled offensive player. Cunningham off the pick from White. No good from outside. Team World trails by three. Ogner with it. Now guarded by Owens. Now Wagner. He has five. Releases. Not going to go that time. Well, you've got to be there defensively. I mean, that's it. The visiting team. For USA. And, and not as many turnovers as, as we often get in this game. So good to see both teams taking care of the ball. Yeah, it really is. I mean, surprisingly, very well controlled for the most part. Sometimes things get a little wild out there, but not so here. Scotty Barnes is out there with Holmgren. Then it's White. Then it's Kate Cunningham. And it's Ivy in at the shooting guard position. And for Team World, they've got Wagner. Josh Giddy is out there with Halpern Shingun. And it's Sohan in at the four. Shingun, no good. Light on the fouls in terms of what's been called tonight. And that's usually the theme in this game. I agree. I mean, the guys always play reasonably hard, but they don't necessarily play physically, if that makes any sense. The officials job. Pretty easy in this one. Honestly, I want to see them crash the offensive glass a little harder here. They were so and Team World making a change here. Sharps checked in, and he can't hit the second. And they're getting to the line a lot in this quarter, guys, and it hasn't been by accident. Yeah, I don't think it's an accident that aggressiveness correlates with playing better. So the aggressiveness is starting to pay off. Wide a screen on Giddy. Cunningham dishes it to White. And foul on the shot. He's alive. And with the offense getting right to the rim, at least they saved the layup. Old school D right there, just telling them no easy layups. It's as simple as that. And that's what you expect from them. Team World leading by five. Wagner outside. Now, here's Sharp. He's been quiet so far. Still no points in the game. Wagner with it. Now defended by MP. The game has been very close in a lot of areas, but rebounding has been the one differentiator thus far. We've seen it time and time again in games. Effort and determination on the glass can make up for a lot of other weaknesses. Good, and it's Barnes picking up the assist. And that's 15 points for MP. And it's Team World with the ball. It's a three-point game. Here's Wagner. Driving the lane. Here's Shengu. So that'll be it for the first half. Fairly even battle score. Your USA team. 28. Team World. 31. as we resume the action at the Rising Stars Challenge. Some great careers in store for these young men. And what a showcase this game has been for the league's best and brightest young stars. And you know, one of my favorite things is seeing the camaraderie between the players. I mean, both of these teams really enjoy playing together and against each other. We've got Cunningham. White is up there with Dan Carroll. Then there's Scotty Barnes. And it's Ivy in at the two. So that's where Eric Spolstra starts the second half with. Here's Shengun. And he makes that one. Shengun's got the first points to start out the third quarter for Team World. Pass to Ivy. Light a screen. Down low. 
He just cannot miss. Eight up, eight in. Wallace. Yeah, a natural score. Ivy is developing into a tremendous playmaker. Team World leading by three. And here is Giddy. Passes it to Shengu. Wagner trying to get open, and he could not. Second person for our first team battle. Out the line for Team World. Out for Shengu. Taking two shots. And he makes both free throws. Well, he's got a great stroke from the line. That's not something we can say about all the league's big guys. Cunningham against Giddy. Cunningham passes to White. Good, and the assist goes to Cunningham. White's got four points now in the quarter. They are just killing him on the interior. Yeah, you can't say that with enough emphasis. I mean, the defenders are just not being aggressive enough down low. you got to play with some physicality in the paint. USA trails by three. Has to Cunningham. For the tie. Gets it to go from beyond the arc. Cunningham's got himself going there. His first points of the game on the deep ball. Here's Giddy. Two minutes gone by in this half. Now the pass to Wagner. And he slams it one-handed. And despite the size. Team World's five right now. We've got Alperon Shangun. Wagner is out there with Josh Giddy. And it's Matherin in at the two guard. It's deflected. And, and you know what? Defensively, both teams have picked it up as we've gotten a little deeper into this game. A little more competitive fire and intensity and being shown out there now. And out of bounds is Team World. Into the lineup for Team World. Checked in for Team World. Team World with the ball. Pass to Giddy to take the lead. It's hauled in by USA. Cunningham looking it over. Inside. Barnes kicks to Ivy. There's a screen. But three. It's the three point pop. Ivy's got the fourth quarter starting here with a bucket for USA. And if Ivy can hit that shot with consistency, it really makes him a tough cover. Giddy the pass to Wagner. Lob pass to Wagner. Up high to stuff the alley -oop. Go up and get that thing, Wagner. Using that seven-foot wingspan to flush home the alley -oop. Cunningham against Giddy. Cunningham dishes it to White. Yo, yo, right here, right here. Rebound by Team World. Shengun's got five rebounds tonight. Sharp the pass to Shengun. And it's sent back by White. And it's out of bounds. Team World will retain possession. with it. Shot clock at six. Passes to Shingu. No luck that time in the shot that would have put them on top. shingu has gone three of ten shooting so far. Only 30%. White setting the big for Barnes. Shoots over Wagner. Barnes can't get it to go. On offense, here's Team World. They played a great fourth quarter defensive, allowing only three points. Wagner wide open. Misses the three. Wagner's gotten just four of his ten shots to fall here, shooting 
White down low. Shangun covering. And the call on the Clearly a foul. Yeah, he took a shot there. Earned those free throws. Shooting for your USA. And the scoring breakdown for USA. The three-pointers and how well they're able to shoot them. You wonder if they can keep it up. And boy, happy. And you know, they've done a fantastic job scoring inside as a result, finding plenty of opportunities to cash in near the hoop. The defenders need to recognize the importance of staying on him as we get into crunch time. Shengun with the rebound. And it's Team World with the ball. The lead is two. Wagner kicks to Giddy. Pass to Sharp. Wagner outside. A pass to Giddy. A three ball. And it's White with the rebound. White's got rebound number 12 here already in the game. One thirty-five left in the fourth quarter. In, and his hot hand continues. 10 of 11 from the floor and looking for more. And you want him taking big shots for you in big moments. That one was as easy as it gets. Well, you don't want to give him any open shots at this stage. Never mind the layup. Come on now. My goodness. Wagner kicks to Giddy. Back to Wagner. Now, here's Sean. There's the pick from deep. No good that time. Right inside. Shangun covering. Barnes. It counts. Oh, oh you just lost the three. With absolutely no fear. Cool, calm, collected, and confident in the biggest moment of the game? Yes. Wagner against Barnes. Puts it up from 12, and it's Wagner missing. Hello. I'll be right outside, thanks. When you smile, you are so pretty, you know? When you smile, your smile is so beautiful.
We're so small as we Dishes to Dan Carroll. Ivy passes to White. Cunningham outside. Gets the three to four. And for them to score the Four seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. Shingun passes to Wagner. Pass to Giddy. Can they get it? Got it! And he has brought them to within two points. And such a clutch shooter. I mean, he lives with a big shot. And when he's rolling like this, watch out. And they foul intentionally. They're going to have to do that now again and again. They're not in the penalty yet. That's right. No other option. Time to focus now on the second. And Cunningham is used to having the spotlight on him. Taking Team on the chance to come up big. Seven seconds left to play here in the fourth. Guys, your thoughts? Big chance here to tie it with a bucket. A critical possession, no doubt. We'll see what they draw up. From deep three-point range, and it's over. It came down to this one foot. Team 67, the visiting team. 65. Thank you, everyone, for making it. Are they did? Gentlemen.